I spent nearly $12,000 to 3D print this dragon, and it was completely worth it. Let me tell you how. Three years ago, I got my first ever 3D printer, an Ender 3 Pro. Excited to get started with 3D printing, I jumped on over to Thingiverse, which is a 3D modeling website, downloaded a bunch of cool things, clicked print, and created these masterpieces. After a year, I'd printed hundreds of models, and I'd used those models to build a platform on TikTok of over a million followers at the time, and I started selling those prints through my website, which led to me buying another printer and increasing the means of production. So how does that mean that this dragon cost me $12,000 to make if an Ender 3 Pro is $200? Well, this wasn't printed with an Ender 3 Pro. Earlier this year, I backed a project on Kickstarter for this beast of a 3D printer, the Bamboo X1 Carbon. This printer is the fastest printer I have ever seen and is capable of printing things that on these printers would take 20 hours in as little as 4 to 5 hours and prints like this which on these printers would take almost 48 hours in as little as 10 hours. But is that worth over $10,000? No. So why did I pay that? $12,000 could do a lot of things for me right now in life. It could buy me a new car, it could move me out of my parents' attic, and it could mean that I didn't have to buy the cheapest beer in Tesco, and I could actually drink something that didn't taste like watered-down piss. This here is my Kickstarter receipt showing you that I did in fact spend almost $11,000 on the new printer. And I am aware that at the beginning of this video I said I spent $12,000, but I didn't realize it was only $11,000, and I'm too lazy to go back and change that. So why did I spend all of this money on a printer when I could have spent it on something better? Well, I sort of didn't spend that money. So I did spend $11,000, just not the dollars you're thinking of. You're thinking of US dollars, and 11,000 US dollars on a 3D printer would be fucking ridiculous. However, the dollars I spent were Hong Kong dollars. At no point did I lie about how much I'd spent, I just sort of didn't tell you the whole truth and assumed you'd think in US dollars. 11,000 Hong Kong dollars is still a lot to spend on a 3D printer. It's about 1,400 US dollars, which is a lot considering these printers are really good and they're only about 220, 250 dollars each. So, is it worth that much? To be honest, yes. I do think it's still worth seven times the price of these. Do I recommend you buying one if you're into 3D printing? Yes. If you've never 3D printed before and you have a load of cash lying around, absolutely buy one of those. However, if you want to try out 3D printing and you're just a beginner and you don't know what to do, you just want to give it a go, I'd highly recommend an Ender 3 Pro. None of this is sponsored, but I do recommend the Ender 3 Pros if you're a beginner or if your mum and dad have a lot of money and you have their credit card, definitely buy one of these for yourself. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a like. Make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any more videos. I'm going to put out a lot more 3D printing content over the next couple of weeks, so make sure you're around for that. Also, the links to all my other socials are in the description, including my Discord, so jump on over there. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.